Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video, if you haven't guessed by the title, is going to be another unboxing video from me and it's been actually quite a while since I last did my unboxing video. So I do like watching these videos. Um, let me know what you guys think about these unboxing because personally I'm very nosy so I like to know what people bought and it's so exciting almost like watching someone um, opening up a Christmas present or like a birthday present so I really really like that I really like watching unboxing videos and I quite like making these um, unboxing videos as well I think it's almost like excitement on a new level so yeah today I have my um, unboxing video for you guys and if you haven't guessed by the title I actually went to Chanel and I picked up something that I wanted forever but they never had my size in so yeah um, off chance I was in London about two weeks ago and I decided to go into the boutique have a look and they actually had it in stock in my size as well so I thought I need them they are amazing they're definitely made for me so yeah I went ahead and tried them on I picked it up and I was so so excited so yeah as you can probably see these are from Chanel and I have done a few Chanel unboxings in the past and it's almost becoming like a little bit of an addiction because I do tend to browse their website quite a lot I'm almost almost on Instagram all the time looking at Chanel shoes and it's definitely more of a cult um, favourite as well so yeah I thought I'd do a unboxing showing you guys what I picked up because these are just so so amazing I'm really really excited and funny fact that I actually haven't opened these um, for the last two weeks so since I came back from London I have just been so busy I haven't even had time to sit down to film this video um, so yeah they've been in the box for the past two weeks and I've been itching to show you guys or actually itching just to wear the shoes but I I wanted to do this video first and show you guys what I picked up because they are just so so amazing so yeah without me waffling on too much let's get started so these are the shoes I ended up picking up and well this is the box so I'm just going to do the unboxing and show you guys what I picked up so just going to unravel it which is probably my favorite part because I just love like kind of unwrapping things um, not so much the wrapping but definitely the unwrapping is one of my favorites um just going to take the bow off and then so they come in the classic black box which i really like and usually i do keep my boxes um only because i like to put my shoes back in them and they kind of wear a bit longer and yeah i just like keeping a box and a box is such a beautiful um product as well and let me show you what i picked up inside so inside they have the um shoe bags which i think is really important um to keep your shoes in because obviously you are paying that much money for your shoes so if you are traveling you want to protect them so i usually take these along with me whenever i'm traveling or popping these in a case so yeah i usually keep these and then inside the tissue paper this is the exciting Part, I actually picked up some ballet flats um, from Chanel now I had my eyes on these for a while I actually tried these on in Paris but they didn't have my size so um, I tried quite a few um, different places in London before they didn't have my size either so I kind of given up on them because I can never get my hands on them so yeah off chance I was in London and they actually had my size so which is really great and I'm going to show you what these shoes look like so these are what they look like they are just some beige um, and black um, lambskin leather um, ballet flats and I actually really like these because they're really simple and but they're really iconic at the same time classic timeless Chanel and funny fact that when I was picking these up, um, someone else tried the exact same pair on, so I kind of thought, you know, it must be a popular pair. But I also tried on the caviar leather one, which is an all black quilted leather. I really like that. I really wanted a long wearing pair of shoes. But the thing that really put me off the other ones, the quilted caviar ones, was the fact that they're black. If they're beige and black, I would definitely got them. But because they are just plain black, I really like the fact that they're caviar though, because generally caviar is a little bit more long wearing, and I like. Like to look after my shoes I wanted a pair of long wearing ones but unfortunately I didn't go for them only because they were black and I have so many pairs of black shoes and I wear black to work generally every day so I just wanted something with a little bit of color so I went for these ones instead and when I tried them on they were love instantly I fell in love with them they were so so amazing and I really like the fact that they're really simple so they are just like a beige with a black toe cap and then you have the quilted um sort of embossed details of the cc which i really like it's really understated but 
they are just really classic and I think these would go really nice with just a black outfit or if you're just wearing a pair of jeans and like a shirt I think this would look really really classic and chic and the other fact I like about them is that they fit really true to size because I usually go for a 37 but with the caviar I went for a 37 and a half um so they fitted really well but I like these more and I just love the leather I think the lambskin leather is so soft and usually I'm more of a caviar leather girl but this one I love the lambskin and the actual heel of it is a decent about an inch so I feel like it's got a lot of support when you walk in them and they have a really lovely sort of bow detail in the front as well and I did get told that if you are wearing jeans with them make sure you fold them up because they do tend to mark um, the um, canvasy bits here but yeah I'll definitely take good care of these and I'm really really smitten about them and they actually look really big on camera but I promise you they're only a size 37 and they fit true to the size they look really elegant and yeah um, what else do I have to say about these? They have the um, Chanel logo on the bottom and the other thing that um, I was told to um, look after these shoes was if you are wearing these pretty much every day or on a regular basis make sure you um, get a plastic insole or like a rubber insole um, inserted to look after them a bit longer so they wear for a bit better so um, I guess I would do that but overall I'm just so so smitten about these they are just so gorgeous so classic and I wanted a pair of flat shoes that I can wear um, with any outfit or um, something that is quite smart at the same time because I do wear heels um, to work day to day so I wanted a pair of flats that are smart enough but you can almost uh, dress it down or dress it up as well and I've seen these I fell in love with them I actually really like the um, beige and a black I think the beige and a black is more of a classic um, style of Chanel and I think classic ballet flats are definitely simple iconic Chanel and yeah I'm really smitten about these these are such a good quality as you would expect from Chanel and I definitely will be getting a lot of wear out of these I think even during the winter time you can wear them with tights and a dress which is what I'll be doing and they would just transform an outfit as well so yeah I'm really happy about these and let me know in the comments if you have these or if what you think about them but generally I'm really happy these are my first ever Chanel flats and yeah I can't wait to wear them and I'm so glad I've done this unboxing video for you guys as well so these are my classic um, Chanel flats so that's it guys for my unboxing video thank you very much for watching I hope you all enjoyed it let me know in the comments what you think like I said and please give it a huge thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't and I tend to upload every um, Sunday or sometimes every Friday depending on how busy I am but usually it's every Sunday so yeah thanks for watching I shall see you next week for a brand new video bye guys <laughs>